pirate's life for me. Hey guys, it's Bro you Whack, and we got the fourth and final regular season Overwatch League skin, which is featuring Bastion in his pirate ship skin. This could not have been more of a perfect skin to give Bastion. Inspired from the popular comp that you really only use Bastion in, like this is really the only time that he's viable, where you put Bastion on a payload, and you put a Reinhardt shield in front of him, hopefully a pocket mercy, maybe a bad T-Sit mortality field, and you absolutely tear through the competition, while the Overwatch League decided to make a skin around that exact same comp for the boy Bastion. Because Bastion is a pretty thick boy, most of the skin is made up of a pirate ship, but there's little elements and little details that also further enhance that this is a pirate ship. You have the sails which have the popular logo with the skull and sword that are more exposed when you go into turret form. You also have that same logo on his tiny little pirate ship hat that is a little bit crooked where his face is made up, I want to say, of like a pirate ship light to shine light on, you know, the scum that is in the water. You also have a turret that whenever you go in a turret form that has a little tiny flag too that spins with it. You also have anchors on the foot. This is something that I noticed when he went into a sitting emote which was absolutely adorable. But of course when you use his ultimate, when you go into his tank form, you finally have a pirate ship can to rain terror onto your enemies. Yo ho yo ho! A pirate life for me! But how could I forget Bastion's own personal parrot, Potty the Parrot, adopted from Patch the Pirate after he overdosed on ketamine and Spongebob. <laughs> I am absolutely geeked over this skin. Just something about Overwatch League skins hit different than regular event skins. And I think it's because the Overwatch League is actually in tune with the community, but also in tune with the memes. Because we saw this before with the Brigida Goat skin where she actually rained terror on the Overwatch League and in the Overwatch community. So they decided to have a little bit of fun with it and give Give us PTSD every single time we see this skin. Hey, remember what it used to be like before Roll Q? Yeah, you better thank us for adding that in Overwatch. But then here comes Bastion with his pirate ship comp inspired skin to also remind us, hey, don't forget about me, because even though I might be the worst hero in Overwatch and I'm gonna get a huge rework in Overwatch 2, I can still destroy yo comp. So if you want to celebrate by buying the skin, it is available in the Overwatch League shop for 200 League tokens or $10 for two weeks. And if you can't just buy the Overwatch League tokens straight up, you can watch the Overwatch League on the Overwatch League website and get tokens that way. But yeah, guys, let me know what you think about this pirate ship skin for Bastion. Well, it's only sprinkles of content every now and then while we would really love that free FFA map that they were supposed to bring before, you know, the whole allegation dropped. This is a nice introduction or reintroduction to content dropping for Overwatch and soon enough we're probably gonna get the Halloween event in early October and hopefully that FFA map I mean there's no reason why they would make it and then drop it eventually but I'm sure they're just waiting for a right time to drop it at least for this Overwatch League skin they're probably testing out the waters and seeing okay is it appropriate to be dropping content right now and some people say it wouldn't be the best time but I mean the Overwatch League is happening and that's a whole different conversation for a whole different day but anyway guys I love you guys thank you guys for watching more overwatch videos to come and bye